Hi, I'm Laurie Strawhacker, an online chemistry tutor. Thanks for joining me today. So today I'm going to talk about a subject that happens so often in chemistry. And that is when you get your test and you realize you're failing. Now, most people seek me out during that time. So don't feel like you're the only one. It happens often. What also happens is the discussion um, that centers around why that failing might take place. So I just want you to know I am going off some notes. So if you see me reading, um, it's just to keep me, you know, within a certain parameter uh, as far as time is concerned. So um, a lot of times, let me go back to that. You failed your chemistry test and you're heartbroken because you really thought you could do it. And I know you, you're the determined type. Um, I was the determined type as well. And when I put my time and my effort into it and it didn't turn, wasn't turning out the way that I'd really hoped it would turn out, then boy, that can be so frustrating. So a lot of students, again, come to me and they say, these are the reasons. And, you know, we spend a lot of time talking about, you know, how the teacher teaches or that, you know, teacher didn't say that that was on the test or the quiz. And I get it. Communication is important, but we still have to come back to what are you going to do about it? Um, at times I've seen students give up and maybe they don't want to listen in class. They just stop doing their homework because it's too difficult and unfair that it's taking too long. Again, I have to ask, what are you going to do about it? And I'm sure I'm not the only one in your life that's saying that. What I'd like to say is, I know it works and you must build your skills. So I created a video, um, problem solving tips for chemistry, and I created another video, math is a language of chemistry, and better yet, I didn't finish all of the math that's involved in that video. Um, I created a PDF, the Need to Know Math and Algebra Quick Guide for Chemistry Students, and you can download that uh, down below. And I'll link the other videos that I made as well. The truth is, there are a variety of great videos out there, even better creators than me, um, but you're here for a reason. And my guess is that, that you're struggling because you need support. Education is personal and time, it's time spent alone, thinking and preparing and and what if others around you, they, they don't understand? Or what if others around you just don't care? I love the fact that you reached out and that you found me on, on YouTube because I am here. And I believe that you can do this. I did it. And if I did it, I know you can do it. I didn't have the support like you. I, I found the support. And... Um, I can list a million other I didn'ts that kind of define what our life story is, but the question keeps, you know, it keeps asking, what are you going to do about your grades? Some have asked me if I think they should drop their chemistry class to protect their grade. Now, this is a difficult, you know, individualized question to ask. And what I want to just tell you a little bit about is, you know, my own story. Um, when I went to school to get my degree in chemistry, um, I, I didn't, it, had, it wasn't straight out of high school. So what I did was I took an introductory chemistry class at a community college and I got a solid foundation. When I went to 
the university, I ended up um, taking a general chemistry one class and I found people who were studying dentistry or wanting to become doctors who were struggling in their general chemistry class. And um, what I knew and understood was that I had this solid, solid background. So that is the key for chemistry. And if you are in general chemistry one and you have some big goals and you're, this grade is the only one that's defining you to become that doctor, then you might want to slow that down and drop the class, take an introductory class and get that, that, that foundation. Maybe you don't want to spend the extra money. Um, there are resources. I'm creating uh, a, a video class so that you can have an introductory chemistry class. Um, wouldn't necessarily be university level, um, but it's, it's definitely the thing that will get you to the next level. Now, let me say this as well. I've had students who came to me who didn't know algebra at all. So their foundation was very, very unhealthy um, for chemistry. <laughs> um, and they had me, worked with me multiple times during the week, and they learned their chemistry along with me. So, you know, if you want to spend the money on a, obviously I'm, I'm a tutor, if you want to spend the money on having a tutor so that you can get through that class, that is an option. But you have to recognize that regardless of having a tutor, you have to put in the energy and the time and build your skills. So um, my answer is always, my go-to is always work on your skills. So with that said, I hope you take a look at my other videos. Uh, the ones that I mentioned, they're listed below. Um, you can subscribe and like this channel. I'm here for you, and I definitely would love to take the time to do a 30-minute consultation. It's free um, to see whether or not we're a good fit. Take a look. You'd have to find me at lauriestrawhacker.com in order to do that, or you can, you know, post a comment, and, you know, I can get some information to you. Uh, we could schedule something. I know it's important to have support. With that said, happy solving.